last year Women's Swimming finished uh, sixth in the NEC. Um, really looking forward to building upon that this year. Um, we have uh, everyone returning from last year, including uh, Courtney Griffith, Kat Koppler, Trisha Yam, who all um, placed well, scored us some, some pretty high points last year. Uh, we also have added as freshmen um, Aaron Reagan, uh, Ann Thielen, and Amanda Malmstrom, all of whom should uh, help us increase our point totals at the conference meets. Um, and we're also really looking forward to an opportunity this year. Um, Courtney's already qualified for short course nationals. Um, we're going to try and get a few more going before the, uh, before the qualifying period ends. Uh, that'll be a pretty big highlight for the beginning of the season. Um, and then uh, getting ready for conferences, try to score some more points again this year. This year, we're <laughs> expectations are certainly higher than they have in the past. Uh, it's the first time we've ever had a, a full roster um, to go to the conference meet with. Um, so we're, we're certainly looking forward to a higher conference standing, um, hopefully some more, uh, more points and a higher standing at the uh, mid-season invitational at Radford. And um, probably just continue to have a good regular season record. Uh, we've always been strong in the regular season. I'd like to continue that as well. Expectations for Courtney. Um, certainly this year what, what we'd like to see happen is to not only get all conference honors but actually win um, one of her events this year. Um, we're, we're really looking forward to that 100 fly at the conference meets. Um, same goes with Patricia. We're, we're going to look again at that 200 fly as a strong event for um, – for us to have some of our, our first ever um, conference champions. Um, and then certainly we're, we're again, we're looking for a, a build up from, uh, from Kat Koppler, um, move her up in the standings. Um, I, I certainly think that she has the potential to do that this year. So we, um, we're starting the schedule this year with uh, Bloomsburg University is doing Bloomsburg Relays again. We've done that for a number of years. It's a great way to start the season. Um, after that, things are gonna be uh, happening very quickly. We've got, um, uh, big meets with uh, NEC opponents, St. Francis University and Wagner College all in the same week. Uh, and we turn around, we have a, a two-day uh, home duels meet. Uh, it's uh, 14 quad meets, two days long. Uh, pretty big event for us. Um, then we have a um, little bit of time off where we turn around and, and go to Radford and, and try to swim fast for a mid-season invitational. Um, and then it's off to nationals, and the next thing we know it's conferences in a couple of months after that. So it's going to be pretty quick. Um, once things get rolling, they, they happen very quickly for us. Yeah. We've been already training pretty hard. Like we're, I think we just want to really improve, and we want to try to place higher at conferences this year. So just kind of putting like full effort into every single practice and coming in and giving it your all and hopefully improving our times. Um, well, my personal goal this year is um, to hopefully make the Olympic trial cut in the 100-yard hundred butterfly. Um, I'm going to national meets December to try to make that cut. I'm um, about two seconds off, so hopefully – with the training and everything, hopefully the year goes well, and that's my goal for this. For we this have year. four new freshmen this year. Um, we all get along pretty well, so it's it's definitely at each as each year progresses. Like we all get, I feel like we get closer and closer as a team, which kind of makes us I feel like do better in the end. Like we kind of like we press push each other in practice, and uh, yeah. So I think we're very, we're a very close team.